Thrill of the Hunt, level 2. Okay, Manticore, Manticore, Manticore. That was Manticore who spotted us. Where are you going? Is he actually going up here? What is happening? <gasps> and if I camp for 3 seconds... Take... Like, look at this, ladies and gentlemen. What you are witnessing right now is me playing with Gorilla 15 that is as accurate as crazy gun handling, actually. Like, Esther V dot with a siege mode as I go in and a boom smacker. Today I'm going to play with a tank and setup which surprised me the most, the absolute most on the sandbox server testing out new crew 2.0. I am talking about Gorilla 15 and um, Gorilla 15 like it is never seen before. Gorilla 15, what is situationally more accurate and better than SDRV 103B with its gun handling. I am not joking over here. I am not overselling it, ladies and gentlemen. Just watch this and you are going to be amazed. I'm going to show you a couple live battles as well in a moment after I'm done showcasing what I did to this gorilla. And you are going to see my very first battle ever played with this setup and that alone is going to be Quite a mind-blowing battle, at least uh, to me. You know, gun handling-wise, it's just... Uh, wow. It's just wow. This is what Gorilla 15 maybe was supposed to be. Uh, what players thought is going to be. What Gorilla is going to be when it first came out. Okay. So, what I did over here, ladies and gentlemen. Let's not waste any time, right? I decided to boost the dispersion to the max. Uh, dispersion, accuracy aiming time combination. You know, the, the two main things what uh, are good on the paper, but we're actually super trollish on the battle. Coherence, next to ally, tank destroyer, 2.5% better vehicle handling, nice. Situational awareness, quite must have. Brothers in arms, quite must have. Fighting spirit, the main a thing I want to get over here, of course, is the Fighting Spirit. After every 1,800 damage points I do, my vehicle handling is increasing 2.5%, right? Up to 7.5%. Nice. Secondly, one of the main things, position preparation. Gun dispersion of a stationary vehicle is decreased by up to 5% at first, but for me up to 7% because I used both my instructors over here, uh, the uh, secondary skill over here, and the first skill I boosted his vulnerability expert from 0 to to max you can use whatever you want you can use close combat well for gorilla i don't recommend it uh, concentration or adrenaline rush as well you can use all those things uh, as the first instructor skill which gives five you know because it is not maxed out but um, i just you know decided to pick this one uh, technical training a couple points to repairs couple points to concealment rationing safety measures as well because the main the absolute one of the most broken skills over here in this game is thrill of the hunt after hitting 5 enemy tanks and penetrating them, my uh, gun dispersion, aka accuracy, you know, and aiming time are decreased up to 10% for the rest of the battle. And oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, this is a game changer. Hopefully this will be uh, tuned because it is way too strong right now. And uh, smooth ride, just to, you know, to make our dispersion better. Uh, gun dispersion on movement and hun on hull rotation, all those things are better. And so this is how the uh, crew looks like, and uh, boy, <laughs> like, just wait, guys. Using standard tank on rammer, using bounty, uh, aiming, just to make our uh, aiming circle even better, minus 8% uh, to the aiming circle size, and a bounty gun laying drive as well. Trust me, ladies and gentlemen, this makes a huge difference if you use it uh, on Krilla 15, even though it has very good stock aiming time. But, you you know, you have to understand how aiming time works, then you understand how this works as well, how, how much this can help, actually. Uh, I'm actually not using any directives, I'm using uh, chocolate, because this is the type of setup uh, I would have on the live server right now as well. Look at this, and look at this right now. 1.13 a second aiming time with all the things active when all the all the passive skills are going to be active as well it is under one second or let's simply say one second aiming time accuracy starting accuracy 0 0.21 
it is definitely going to be under 0 0.20 when all the things are active once more. And all the other positive effects right over here, you can see coherence, fighting spirit, and all those things when those kick in. It's massive. Position preparation, gun dispersion of a stationary vehicle decreased by 7%. Even stationary. So you can see where this um, goes under uh, 0 0.20, right? I don't know, like uh, 0 0.18, something like that. Uh, 0 0.18, 0 0.17 dispersion, like never seen before dispersion on Gorilla 15. So let me show you what the heck happened in the live battle. Let's go. So let's start pumping out some extra accuracy, some extra gun handling, just like that. Boom. Just remind me not to shoot EBRs uh, because, uh, you know. There is no reason to do that. Uh, you are not able to damage them. Just, you know, keep that in mind. There is absolutely no reason to shoot EBRs because you can't damage them anyway. Quite crazy aiming time, I might say. Thrill of the hunt, level 1. Uh, thrill of the hunt, level 2. EBR is dead. Beautiful. I just got blind fired, by the way, by someone. Krilla has very, very bad camo. That might have been a hit, actually. That might have been a hit, but no penetration. What? I didn't get spotted, actually, versus that Manticore. Thrill of the Hunt, level 3, and... We have first team, uh, not team. Fighting spirit as well. It's like my accuracy, dispersion, my aiming time is already better by 8%. Both things are better by 8% already. Plus vehicle handling. Okay, so let's do a little test. Let's do a little test. Let's see. Fully aimed in, position preparation comes in, and boom, even smaller. There is enemy Gorilla 15. Okay, let's see. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I think I'm not spotted anymore. There is E3. Fighting Spirit, level 2. Manticore. Manticore is not able to spot us. Weird. Like, what type of equipment unit is Manticore using if he's not able to spot us over here? That's actually a bit weird. Boom. Just like that. So maximum thrill of the hunt. We have minus 10% to the dispersion. To the aiming time. 5%. Better vehicle handling. And now, if I am going to be up over here. And if I camp for 3 seconds. They, like, look at this, ladies and gentlemen. What you are witnessing right now is me playing with Gorilla 15. That is as accurate as crazy gun handling. Actually. Like... Esther V does with a siege mode. They shouldn't have even tried. Well said, Chuck Norris. This is the craziest Gorilla 15 I have officially ever seen. <laughs> look at this aiming time. And I'm not even... Or aiming time. Look at this gun handling. And I'm not even... Uh, using the position preparation, which makes our accuracy even better. Have I missed a shot? With a gun handling like this, Gorilla 15 can easily be the best tank destroyer in this entire game. I'm going aggressively. Well, yeah, I'm going aggressively. All the artillery is up there. Don't care much about that, right? 644. Well, it still has the uh, good old German, uh, you know, low roll RNG, but. Uh, oh, yeah, you get the point. Right. Wait a minute, why are artillery still alive? Okay. EBR is dead. Patch it should be reloaded on time, actually. Right? They 
beautiful. A little bit of lag, but beautiful. 8322 damage. 6 kills. And position preparation kicked in now. With maximum fighting spirit. Maximum. First battle. First battle officially with this setup right over here live together with you 10% better aiming time right let's say one second aiming time i had under 0.20 accuracy because all the vehicle handling boosting things or dispersion then uh, uh, when i had the maximum thrill of the hunt uh, then when the position preparation perked kicked in when everything kicked in i had under 0.20 Dispersion, 100%. I mean, ooh, this actually might be quite a snipey battle. Let's see, triple light tank action, though. How crazy are those guys going to be? I don't know. Either way, whenever I'm playing with EBR or some light tanks, you know, just a little dip uh, to help out your camping tank destroyers, who usually are dealing damage uh, and you get assistance as a light tank. I like to knock over those trees right as I go in and uh, boom, smacker. <laughs> uh, they didn't even have time to blink. Hey, Chuck Norris, I believe that is the best line. That is the best timing for that line you have ever said. No doubts. Okay, Manticore, Manticore, Manticore. That was Manticore who spotted us. Where are you going? Is he actually going up there? What is happening? Oh! <gasps> <laughs> that guy was not visible. I uh, I received a blind hit, which means, uh, well, you can see the Thrill of the Hunt level 2 and uh, Fighting Spirit as well. Over HP of damage done. So we know that it was actually a hit, ladies and gentlemen. Position preparation. That's a good sign, you know. If the skill upgrades to another Thrill of the Hunt level, if you hit... Uh, uh, a tank what you have not which you have not hit before blindly that basically confirms your blind hit you know manticore coming back and bye bye garage is calling you but we're not able to do much more over here You actually keep pushing forward. That's very ballsy of you. That is very ballsy of that um, 400 for you. No, RT. I was not spotted still. What the heck? Was it still spotted? I was spamming. Uh, did you see, by the way, what I did? I was spamming uh, my heal. I was spamming my heal just to... Thrill of the Hunt. Oh, yeah. And Fighting Spirit as well. Level 2. Beautiful. So, over 3,600 damage done. That means uh, uh, directly uh, that. So, yeah. This is Krilla 15, ladies and gentlemen. In front of you. Made more accurate. Gone better than on HDRV in many situations. You have seen those shots. You have seen everything. You know, when we had the maximum Thrill of the Hunt. When we had the maximum... When we had the maximum... Uh, basically everything. It, it's just, you know, it's just nasty. Like, look at that! Look at that aiming tag! It's simply nasty. Ladies and gentlemen, it is simply nasty. Blind. 776. Thrill of the Hunt, max. So, let's uh, let's actually, let's do this. Let's aim in and let's see how much this uh, other aiming, so aiming unit helps. And it visibly was... Did you see that? Did you pay attention? It went visibly smaller. And another battle with uh, third level of uh, fighting spirit as well. So we have over 5,600 damage. Uh, not 600, 5,500 5, should be, you know, on average. Yeah, ladies and gentlemen. Let me know what you think about that in the comment section down below for me. Uh, this uh, I have not played... I have honestly not played with better version of Gorilla 15 ever. This is the best version of Gorilla 15 I have ever played. Is it too much? 
Is it too broken? Is it too crazy? Comment section is for your ideas. Please let me know. If you enjoy my stuff, if you enjoy my weird tests over here, also hit the like button or hit the dislike button. 5,576 damage done. Crazy battles. Crazy battles. 888.com. Not sponsored, by the way. Not the sponsor. This guy had fun. This guy had absolutely immense amount of fun. Guys, much love. Stay awesome. Stay subscribed. Stay sexy. Let me know what you, what you would like to see me testing next time. Stay awesome. Take care and bye.